Arcade's greatest hits. Sweet. We get to play more than one game today. Williams Arcade's Great of uh, What the fuck? Don't do that to me, man. Right when I'm trying to read. The fuck? The Digital Eclipse Design Team. Is this a uh, Commodore 64 game now? I'll give him. I'll give him credit. It's kind of fancy. I like it. Hey, we got some good games here. Let's play some Defender first. All right, let's see. That is the shoot button. That is the explode button, apparently. That is the bomb button. Okay. What? Why? Why does this even exist? What does that button do? I am defending! I must defend! Oh, I'm the worst. Why did they choose me? They could have had such better defenders. Actually, I'm just getting used to the momentum of this game. Let's try again. Now I know how this ship controls. I should be a little bit better at this. Okay, I lied. Blatant, ah, uh, absolute lie. You know, I don't even think it matters where I go. Cause he's a mother. Oh fuck! They shoot at me. Yeah. I just got out of of pilot school. I'm not ready for this. But turns out, I I guess I had the only ship in the world, or maybe the all the everybody else just already died. There's like three other people. No, you made me shoot my girlfriend there. That god damn it. Now it's on. I can never forgive these guys. Oh well, I still have eight girlfriends left. What is that? I want it. Oh, that's a bad thing. It was flashing, damn it! I thought it was a power-up. But this is an like old Atari game or some shit, so I should not have expected a power-up. I really shouldn't have. But you know what? It's okay, because I've started over, and all of my girlfriends are intact. We've got nothing to worry about, except the fact that I suck horribly. Stay away from my girlfriends! Oh, God damn it! Why are they so willing to go? I don't get it! I worked so hard to round them up on this planet! Alright, enough of this game. Let's go to the next one. Defender 2. This is the sequel. We're on another planet now. Oh, Jesus. I still suck at defending my girlfriends. Oh, Jesus. I really need to not fly towards things, ever. Just stay in one spot. Oh, what is that? I want to know what that is. Go in it. I went in it. And nothing really happened of use, so I'm never gonna do that again. God damn! The momentum on this thing! It's ridiculous. That's enough defending. Let's go to Joust. Classic game. Man, this is like the worst version of these games or something. I don't even remember how to play this. I think you have to, like, be above someone when you hit them. Anyway, you're a knight on an ostrich. Fighting other knights on other ostriches. That's the whole game. There's nothing else to it. Sound effect shit though, this can't possibly be what they meant to have happen.
Surely there was really music in here and this ROM's just corrupt or something. Because even the NES version of this game is better than this shit. But hey, we're not playing the NES version of this game. We're playing Arcade's Greatest Hits or whatever. They're getting fast. Wish I had the power glove right now. I'm sure that would help. The sound effect is about to drive me completely batshit insane. Can't take it anymore. Kill me. The game is over. We still got two games. Let's try Sinistar. I know that had sound, so surely it'll work. Oh god, no, it's not. I'm gonna try the other version of this game. Because I can't take this beeping anymore. All right, against my better judgment, I am trying ZSNES. Nope, these ROMs are just fucked. Oh well. All three of them do this, so it, it really doesn't matter. Good games, though, when you can actually not have to listen to this horrible sound effect. Clickety click 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 clickety clickety <laughs> reminds me of my first computer. Like that was the worst thing ever. It was a tri gem, had a whopping 32 megabytes of RAM, a 233 megahertz processor, uh, no video card whatsoever, just built-in internal graphics bullshit. We're on Windows 98. Why am I trying to shoot the women? But it ran Windows 98 Second Edition, and it made a sound constantly. Whenever you did anything, it was all. So clearly, what we're actually playing here is a representation of what it was like to be on the internet when you were freaking Zeta in 2001. God damn, that computer sucked. All right, well, that was Robotron. Pretty fun. Let's go back to uh, the final game now. Sinistar. We don't get to hear him scream at me, though. Sucks. Oh, God. So I don't, I don't actually remember how you're supposed to play this game. You're supposed to mine crystals to make Cinnabombs, apparently. But I can't do anything while these fuckers are shooting me. Anyway, eventually Sinistar comes alive and he's all like, I hunger! Run, coward! And it's kind of cool, but nah, yeah, we're not going to get to listen to that in this version.
These crystals are not easy to pick up. Oh, you bitch. Game is not easy. Hey, there's actually sound in this game, and there I'm dead. Immediately. He just came up and raped my fucking face. I don't know, I've never actually played this game before. But it's good to know that there's actually sound. Let's try that again. Maybe I'll be able to shoot him with a bomb or something. I don't know how this game works. Great, these shooting faggots have come already. Holy shit at all these crystals. Oh god. Got a, a Sinistar. Run, coward. Oh god, there he is. And I got eaten immediately, as usual, but I don't know how to play this game. Which is the which is the bomb button? Okay, that's the bomb button. Well, I blew part of him up before dying. Alright, where is the faggot? I'd rather just spam bombs until you die. I have defeated Sinistar and then I freaked out. So is this like an endless battle of, of Sinistar just keeps coming back to life? Of course it is, it's an arcade game, but why? What is the, the plot behind this game, other than you eventually die? Sinistar is unbeatable. Fuck! Alright, well, I guess that concludes this game of games all of which are pretty fun old arcade games and not really the best versions like uh, of course the best versions are the originals and you could play them on main but it's just like I know that other versions of at least a few of those other games had some sort of sound that isn't a constant clicking beep sort of thing Oh well. Whoa, what's going on? Wonderful.